Morning. How are you today? So coming back yesterday and uh, having a few slight technical issues with um, posting the post, the video again. I think it was a bit of an ID10 t moment, but hey ho, we won't go there. So better luck this time in trying to hit the right button when we finished. Fingers crossed, you never know. Anyway, if you would just like to make yourselves nice and comfortable, maybe shut your eyes if you wish, or even hold a soft focus. The choice is yours, it's whatever you feel comfortable with. If you prefer to meditate with your eyes open, then do so. If you prefer to close them, then that's just fine. And again, if you prefer to meditate sitting down, laying down, kneeling, standing, it's whatever you are comfortable in doing. There's no point in being uncomfortable. Because you just you just won't benefit from the meditation. You'll you'll just be thinking all the time that you're uncomfortable and that you would rather be sitting, laying or or in a different position. So anyway, as I said, just gently close your eyes if you wish, maybe hold a soft focus and let the sound of the bell ring to you. As the sounds fade into the distance, let's just start by taking three extended out breaths, breathing all the way to the end of each breath. And this helps our bodies to relax and calm, which in turn helps our minds to relax and calm. And just gently come back to the natural soothing rhythm of the breath and body as we sit here right now. You may notice your mind might wander off, get distracted start thinking about things. It's what our minds are designed to do from a very young age. We're taught to think. So maybe think about things that you've done yesterday or maybe what you need to do later on today. Memories from the past. thoughts of the future but just knowing you're not getting anything wrong as I said our minds are designed to wander off but the moment you notice is a wonderful wonderful moment of mindfulness you can just acknowledge that your mind has wandered off and just gently and softly bring it back to the present moment, back to the breath, and back to the meditation in hand. Again, you may recognize that your mind continues to monitor the environment around you as it's meant to do. So you may notice things such as sounds from close by or far away. So 
may notice light coming through the windows. You may notice the feel of the air and the temperature around you. Maybe even the clothing or the bed sheets that you're wearing or laying under. All wonderful sensations to have. We can just try to notice these sensations as they come by, just like clouds in the sky. Just acknowledge that they're there. And just come back to the meditation, come back to the present moment and the breath. Or you could choose to run with the thoughts, the sensations, the memories. Start thinking about them, fantasizing about them. Allowing your mind to run with whatever enters your head. The choice is yours. As we sit here meditating this morning, just concentrate on the next in breath that you take. Notice the feeling of the air as it enters the body. And then notice any sensations your body may have. Notice the feeling of the body moving with each and every breath that you take. Maybe just place your hands on your abdomen, the tummy, and feel the difference between all the breaths. Feel the difference between the long breaths that you take and the short breaths. Notice the rise and fall, the expansion and contraction. Notice the feelings that are generated.
just notice each and every aspect of your breathing. The in breath. The out breath. Even that little pause at the end of the out breath just before you breathe in again. is a fraction of a second just before you start breathing again so for a few minutes just notice just see if you can notice that pause that stillness at the end of each and every out breath that you take It's always there. It keeps coming with each and every in breath and out breath. Just see if you can feel where you feel that pause, that stillness within your body. There's no right nor wrong answer for this, you just feel it where you feel it. Maybe you feel it in your throat. Maybe you feel it in your tummy. Maybe in your back. Maybe 
even all the way down your foot. You just feel it where you feel it. And this place that you do feel it is your inner refuge, your still place. where you can go just to notice things as they happen. So for a little while just practice resting in your inner refuge and noticing everything that happens around you. Noticing that the world continues to evolve and rotate and move on. A place where you can notice all those thoughts, those sensations, those happenings. A place where you can do all of this at that right level of concentration. You're all okay. How did you get on with um, finding that little pause at the end of each and every breath? Did you manage to find it okay? Did you find the location in your body where you where you felt that? 
mine I always feel right here. It has never ever moved since the day I found it. Some people's they move all the time and they feel it anywhere on their body. So feeling it down in the foot or maybe the arms and that is not as daft as it sounds. Anyway, maybe have a practice again later on today or even tonight. See how you get on with that. Just let us know in the comments box below how you got on or maybe message us as well. So thank you. Anyway, as I said, have a good day or I hope you've had a good day. Depends when you're watching. Um, if you're watching on Facebook, then like and follow us. If you're watching on YouTube, then please subscribe. If you're watching on iTunes, then subscribe again so you get notified when the new videos arrive. So, thank you very much indeed. I'm hopefully going to hit the right button now to get this uploaded onto Facebook so we can then put it onto YouTube and iTunes. And we will see how we get on. So, See you later. Thank you very much indeed. Let's hope we don't have another ID10T moment. <laughs> See you later. Bye-bye.